Welcome to the Loud House, Citizens Bank Park in Philadelphia. This is the 2023 National League Division Series featuring the Braves and the Phillies. The Phillies holding a 2-1 lead in this best of five series. Ranger Suarez, while left-handers struggled all season against the Braves, Suarez one of those guys who has had great effectiveness against Atlanta. I don't know, I might let him go a little bit longer depending how it is, but we gotta believe it's a lot like game one. Him to the bullpen. Ronald Acuna steps in. Bouncing ball to Turner. Out number one, and away we go. Outside of the three innings in game two, the Braves have been very quiet, and you got to give this Phillies pitching staff a lot of credit. They have held down the most prolific offense in the league this season. Zalby's out in front. Lazy little pop-up. Bryson Stott is there, and two men are out. Riley into center field. In his tracks, Rojas, and a 1-2-3 start for Ranger Suarez. Phillies fans turning up the volume here at Citizens Bank Park. They chanted Strider's name. Chance of we want Strider raining down right now. Uh, you know he's sitting there listening to it. So you want to talk about fuel on the fire. Thought this series would have a little action yeah. in it, right? The juice, it is full of juice. Yep. Dripping with drama. They want Strider and they got him here tonight in game four. A dominating force in the regular season. A 20 game winner with a 3-8-6 ERA was excellent in game one. Schwarber has just two hits in the series. One of those that lead off double against Strider. And he strikes out Schwarber. High fastball at 100. Only one of those pitches was below 99 miles an hour, right. Larry. Well, you got to figure he's going to be a little bit amped up. Here's Trey Turner. 0 for 17 in his career against Strider. And Turner lines one left field. One hopper off the wall. And a belly flop double for Trey Turner. Well, he started this game with six straight fastballs at 99 to 100. On this one, he threw the slider. If that pitch is down in the zone, probably gets a ground out or swing and miss, but this one hung a little bit, and Turner now gets his first hit off Spencer Strider. His second double of the series. Runner in scoring position right away for Bryce Harper. And that one misses badly. That was a changeup. He's going to put him on now. Yep. He will swing 3-0. and oh. Snitker says... We've seen enough of Bryce Harper. Strider's slider was devastating for Bohm in game one. Did he go? And he did. Chris Guccione, the first base umpire, raises the thumb on Alec Bohm and a big strikeout early for Strider, his second K. Here's Bryson Stott. And the one, two, and Stott. Fly ball into center field. Michael Harris will put it away, and that will retire the side. Ronald Acuna checking the iPad. He's upset about something, maybe missed one on that ground out. How about the Braves? They have not scored in the first inning. This was a dominant team in the first innings. They hit 47 homers. Set a major league record, only two singles in the first four games in inning number one. Two down. Well, at this point, everybody has made contact versus Suarez, but weak contact, very weak contact. That puts the bat in the hands of Sean Murphy. We haven't seen him since game one. Travis Darno was behind the plate each of the last two ball games. Ready for another one, two. Two outs in the second. And a called strike three. Six up, six down for Ranger Suarez. Yeah, there he is. Joel Embiid found the Phillies jersey big enough. He's a big man. And the Sixers center. Castellanos draws a walk with one away. More traffic for the Phillies. We have had base runners in most of the innings of this series. Here's Brandon Marsh. Big night last night as he had three hits. The pitch. And he sends out one into center field. A base hit. Line drive by Marsh. Three hits yesterday. A uh, hit in his first at bat here tonight. And once again, the Phillies threaten two on, one away. And Rojas into center field. That is going to be caught. Harris makes the play. This will be a double play at second base. Wow, what a catch by Harris. Close some ground. That ends the inning and quiets the crowd. Michael Harris with an outstanding catch, and that saves at least a run. Huge play. We head to the top of the third, no score. Ranger Suarez back to work, and Kevin Pilar, first ball swinging deep into left field. Marsh is back. He's got it just in front of the wall. Pilar just missed it by a click on the bat. Good catch by Brandon Marsh. Matchup of Venezuela here, Suarez and Arcia. Roll over ground ball to Turner and a low throw dug out by Harper. Two outs 
in this third inning. Eight straight retired by Suarez. Jam shot grounder. Turner and a low throw gets by Harper. Harris will take a left turn. It is out of play. So Harris to second base. Turner was a little awkward going after that ground ball and then a low throw that Harper couldn't dig. First base runner for Atlanta. Acuna grounded to short his last time up. He's still looking for his first RBI. And Acuna right back to the box. Suarez can really field his position well and he makes a play and a big out early for the left hander from Venezuela. Tyrese Maxey in the house tonight from the Sixers. He was rocking the Harper jerseys. Powder blues are pretty sweet aren't they. Here's Trey Turner who doubled off Strider in the first Inning. And he sends out one into left field to base hit. The former batting champion in the National League is two for two. Here's Harper now. One out, two and two the count to Harper. Base hit into right. Turner will turn and burn to third base. Bryce Harper delivers with a single. And the Phillies for the third straight inning against Strider have two men aboard. Pitch number 49 coming here. One away, third inning. First and third. Boom in the air little flare Albies will make the play Turner not tagging Boom frustrated having a chat with Kevin Long one of the main reasons he's so frustrated he is he knows the opportunities he was going to get in this game the guy in front of you has been doing what he's doing Phillies have him at the corners Phillies are 0 for 4 with runners in scoring position tonight another 3 2 he got him fastball right by him it took eight pitches and Strider blowing the smoke there in the bottom of the third inning to get stopped. Well, Rob, I know you didn't promise Ranger Suarez a longer outing tonight, but it feels like maybe he's earned some more time. Geez, the stuff's really good right now. You know, he's throwing, throwing strikes, getting ahead. Uh, curveball's good. Change-up's good. He's keeping them off balance. He's doing a great job. If Riley can get something going. 0-2, and there's a fly ball deep down the left field line towards the wall. one nothing Braves! Shots fired here in the top of the fourth inning. And it's Austin Riley with another home run to make it one nothing Atlanta. Yeah, baby. Riley puts the Braves in front. It just crept over the wall. And Riley, who hit a huge home run in game two, delivers with his second home run of the postseason. So here come the Braves. A home run by Riley. Olsen with a single on the first pitch. Two men aboard with one away. Ozuna grounded to short his last time up. Bouncing ball. Chance for two here. Turner picks it. Steps on the bag. No problem for a double play. That's a bounce back for Suarez. Strider's strikeout rate in the regular season, 38%. In the postseason, the last couple of years, it was down to 30%. A swing and a miss. Real Muto chases a high fastball at 100 miles an hour. Needed to try to have a shutdown inning right yes. here if you're the Atlanta Braves. One thing the Phillies have done is when other teams have scored all postseason, they've answered right back. Castellanos deep in the left field. It is. Two home runs last night for Castellanos. You heard Matt Weiner earlier talk about off-speed pitches, what the Phillies were trying to attack. The Phillies have an answer once again. I mentioned the Braves have only had a lead after the completion of two innings. No balls, two strikes. Strider rocks back and forth. He's in the wide, the 0-2. Swing and a miss. He got him with a fastball. That's his fifth strikeout. The side is retired, but... Nick Castellanos has tied this game up. A solo home run down the left field line. Golden double play opportunity. If he gets one on the ground, Arcia just serves one into center field. That's going to be caught. Rojas throw to first and safe. Oh, I'm not quite sure what Murphy was doing at second base. He was lagging a little bit. Rojas with a head of steam makes a nice running catch. Arcia retired. Murphy just gets back. Two men are out now. Here's Michael Harris. Harris bouncing ball to Stott. And Ranger Suarez works through the bottom of the Braves batting order. Probably his last batter faced. Five strong. Strider, it has been laborious in this game for him to get through four innings. Third time around now for the Phillies against Strider as we play in the bottom of the fifth. And Schwarber a swing and a miss. Strider with a nasty slider. And that's strikeout number six for Spencer. Of the five hits he's allowed, three of those on the slider. Including Trey Turner's double. He's got one again. Trey Turner turns a slider around and puts the Phillies in front. Just
just under the Lysios Bakery side in left field. Trey Turner is three for three tonight, and he's given the Phils a 2-1 lead as the fireworks go off over the bell in right center field. And that's the beauty. With the Phillies are going, they take advantage of the mistakes. Wow. Harper draws the walk. Third time on for Bryce Harper. So he's now been on base 14 times in this postseason, which is amazing. Unbelievable. And Bohm, bouncing ball to third, Riley to second, out there, Albies to first, and a double play. Frustration mounting here for Bohm, but the Phillies have grabbed the lead. This would be the pitch to do it on a 2-2 count. Let's see what he does. 2-2, and he got him. He threw him a changeup, and Stott swings and misses for out number one, strikeout number seven. Strider has not had a three-up, three-down inning in this game. Castellanos now with two away. Castellanos! Way back! Goodbye! Solo home run! Nick Castellanos has hit his second solo home run of the night, and the Phillies are on top three to one. And this place is exploding. Nobody in Major League history has hit two home runs on back-to-back postseason games. Helmet off. He's greeted by his teammates near the top step. What a couple of games he's had. Brian Snitker's out to the bow. That's it for Spencer Strider. He's going to head off. The Phillies have sent him to the showers. They lead it 3-1. to one. Castellanos, two home runs yesterday and home runs in consecutive at-bats here tonight. The first player in the history of the game to do it in the postseason. Amazing. He walks him back to back walks to the seven and eight hitter. Alvarado had it going. Retired the first three back to back walks. Rob Thompson is out to make a pitching change. We're going to see Craig Kimbrell now in the game in the seventh mm. inning. Typically the eight and nine pitchers the setup and the closer in some way are pitching in the sixth and seventh inning. Darno's first career postseason pinch hit appearance. Three and two, two outs. There they go. And it is a ball low. Three consecutive walks. They are loaded up for Ronald Acuna Jr. And that gets back to the screen. Oh, and Pilar stops. Now racing back to second goes Wall. Ooh, Pilar had a chance, but he didn't quite see it. 45,000 here. They are all standing. And most of them quiet, trying to drum up some noise here. Another one comes. Acuna, fly ball, left center field. On the run is Rojas, and he makes the catch. Rojas was a little shaky, but he hauls it in. The inning is over. Here we go, two outs. 3-1 Philly lead. Olsen, a bouncing ball. Stott, Harper got a late break to first, and they just got him. Harper got stuck in no man's land and he looks hurt that surgically repaired elbow Harper in a collision with Olsen the out is recorded the inning is over but major concern here for Bryce Harper Harper just started playing first base this season and you could tell he wasn't quite sure whether to go for the ball or the bag just left that right arm out there and Olsen clips it on his way by so Harper will exit we'll see if he's able to stay in the game three one Philadelphia they are three outs away from back to back trips to the NLCS good sign Bryce Harper able to return Marcelo Zuna will draw the walk and the Braves will bring the tying run to the plate and now Murphy the all star catcher Murphy a bouncing ball that is through for a base hit. Ozuna on his way to third. Castellanos throw and safe. Oh, a risky move by Ozuna. I agree. Risky move here by Marcel Ozuna, but was able to just get that left hand in right here. Ooh, man. Phillies decide not to challenge. Clearly the hand is in there. Wow, that is close. So look at that. Wow, the wheels in motion here, folks. We are in the ninth inning. The Braves have two on. Matt Strom is going to be next out of this bullpen in the ninth. The reason Kimbrell and Alvarado aren't out here now because they were used earlier in the game in the sixth and the seventh. And Kimbrell going across to the eighth. Strom deals. Pillard, little sawed off handle shot out to Turner. Out number one is the go ahead run at the plate. Ninth inning. Strong delivers Rosario a fly ball left field shallow. Ozuna tagging won't go. Two outs. 
telling me you didn't have Von Grissom getting you at bat with the season on Man, the line. Unreal. Spent most of the year in Triple A. Thought he might have been the starting shortstop in the major leagues this year, but Arcia beat him out. Von Grissom will step in the box. Two on, two out, one and two the count. And did he go? He did! It's over! The Philadelphia Phillies are headed back to the National League Championship Series!